The historic walks of downtown Guilford are an approximately two mile walk around the green and streets around the green, looking at houses and telling stories of the people that live there. On the tour we look at a bunch of big houses, important ones like the Acadian House, the Henry Whitfield House, the monuments. There are a lot of big names that came to Guilford, especially General Lafayette, General Washington. Do you know what distinguishes this house to be on the National Register versus some of the other homes? Not only is it one of the few like Sabbath Day houses remaining in Guilford, there aren't, uh, it's like one of the few Sabbath Day houses remaining in the whole United States. Being in its first year, we trained for an entire week just in the library, coming up with note cards and all different facts that the people going on the tour might be interested in. Before, this was the Guilford Savings Bank. It was actually owned by Mr. David Naughty. He left in his will. His wife could never remarry, and if she did, then she would lose the house and only get his silver tankard, which is a drinking cup. <laughs> and so it's important important to have these tours in Guilford because I don't think that everyone living here, not that they don't appreciate, but they don't know about everything in Guilford. There's a lot of stuff researching it that I never knew before and I'm so excited and even when I'm just out with my friends I'll say that was the house where something happened that's really big or everything. So it just, it's given me a whole new perspective about Guilford.